Hi, I'm Katie Campbell. I'm from Savannah, Georgia, and I'm being made on Threadless. Like most artists, I've, I've always painted and drawn since I was little. Once I got into college, that's when I discovered all the design programs and really became more passionate about the design side of it, not the fine art. I'll go anywhere from doing illustrator vector art, I'll go straight into Photoshop sometimes. I'll do some hand lettering outside of the computer using pencils, charcoal, condiments. You want to be able to adapt your technique to whatever the job is. I would define my style as undefined. It's really all over the place. I, I feel like a lot of artists, especially threadless artists, have a certain style. You can tell right away which design's theirs. I don't want my style to stop me from a concept. I think a strong concept can be followed by the style. My day job is that I'm a graphic designer for Savannah College of Art and Design, and I also am a freelance illustrator and graphic designer at night and weekends when I can fit it in. I've been a part of Threadless submitting designs for probably almost eight to 10 years now. Starting about a year and a half ago, I won my first design contest, and I've had 10 prints in the last year and a half, plus some. I don't even understand what happened. I think I just got comfortable, maybe got more mature, and I was able to figure out what is printable and what's not, and like edit myself a little better. And the fact that I started entering the specific competitions really helped because being a graphic designer, I'm, I'm used to getting direction and having to work quick. And I think that really just helped me focus. The second I started to put up threadless work on my portfolio, I started getting more inquiries from people, like big name clients. Uh, the fact that I was able to work with Gap was amazing. I've learned not to overthink things and try to be like everything else that's out there. I think when I first started, I would see what got printed and I'd be like, oh, I could do that. And I would try to imitate it or do something so it fit in. You know, just do your own thing and who cares? Do a lot of it, put it out there, listen to feedback.